little ones. How are you again? So excited to be with you again. Um, this time we're getting together to make a Father's Day craft. So this one's going to be fun. We're doing handprints again because I think that all your big people in your life, um, I think they treasure your little, your little fingers and your little hands. So you can make this for any of the special big people in your life um, that you want to make this for. Uh, if you have a special um, man in your life that, that, that you love and that helps you out and that you just want to make this special craft for, okay? We're going to make a superhero handprint craft. All right, so let's see who's ready. All right, Em, are you ready? You have to have your hand ready. Let's see. Okay. Haley, are you ready? Just um, help your big person maybe get some supplies ready. Supplies are the things that you need to make your craft, okay? We put some things in your kit, but you also need some things from home. So, um, yeah. So maybe, Lincoln, if you could walk around your house and help your big person get some stuff ready. So you'll need from your kit, you'll need this paper. This is a paper that I just put on this so that you can see what we're doing. It's easier to see when I put it up there. So you'll need your paper, and then there will be this paper in your kit, and I'll show you what to do with all of this, and then you'll have your directions. And I have a towel to dry my hand with because I'm gonna be, because we're gonna be painting our hands, so we're gonna need to wash them. And I have this wet towel to wipe my hand clean. I have, you'll need a glue stick. So Addie, can you go find a glue stick at your house and go bring it so it's all ready? Okay, thank you. Then you're gonna have some paint in your kit, but you're gonna need a paintbrush to go with it because you'll have to paint your hand. So if you can get a paintbrush, um, maybe Molly or Everett or Gianna, uh, maybe one of you three can go get a paintbrush or more. I'm using this kind, which is like kind of like a sponge just because it'll be easier to get it full on there. But if you just have a big paintbrush or even if you have a little one, go ahead and use it. Whatever you have, you go ahead and use it, okay? So you just grab your paintbrush and you're going to be set. Not quite yet because you guys are kind of little. This is washable paint, but maybe if you have um, clothes that are okay to get dirty or a smock. So if you have that stuff, go ahead and go grab it now, put it on, and and your big person probably will have your the table or whatever you're working on protected so that doesn't get dirty. And then we're ready to start, okay? Does everybody have all your stuff? Yeah, Jude? You got your stuff? Awesome. Good job, everybody. Let's get started then. Let's start painting our hand. Pick one hand that you're gonna paint. Your hand is going to be the superhero's cape. Okay, so we are going to, I am going to start painting my hand. I'm gonna paint my hand red. Ooh, it's a little chilly. The paint's a little cold, everybody. <laughs> okay, so red paint, painting my hand. Some of you actually might think this tickles. I know we went through this a little bit ago when we were doing handprints too, right? I would hope you guys are almost used to handprint painting. We like to do handprints when you're little because your hands are so little. And, you know, the big people in your life, we like to remember how little they were. And when you're bigger, I know you don't understand this right now, little ones, but when you're bigger, you're going to be like, my hand was that tiny? And then you can measure it. This is pretty neat. Okay, so I'm putting lots of paint and I'm making sure that it stays wet. Your big person hopefully is going to help you with this. And I am finished with that part. Now I'm going to take my hand, I'm going to spread out my fingers just a little bit, and I am going to put my hand right on top of like his back because that's where his cape should be, okay? 
My hand might be a lot bigger. Well, my hand's a lot bigger than yours, so it's not going to fully fit, but that's okay. And I'm going to put it just like that, and I'm not going to move my hand. Because if I move my hand, then my handprint will smear. And then it's going to be a little bit harder to see how cute your little handprint is. So I'm not moving my hand. Okay, let me put this like this. Okay, then I'm going to push down all my fingers, make sure I got them all on there. Push down my, my hand right here and make sure my palm of my hand, which is this part, <laughs> this part. Okay, make sure that's on there. Push it all down. I still didn't move my hand that's on the paper. Then I'm going to carefully just pull my hand right off. And I have a handprint. Oh, he has a huge cape. <laughs> your guys' capes won't be that big because your hands are a lot littler. But that's it. You just made a cape for your superhero. Now, go ahead and wash your hand off. You can use a wipe or a rag, or you can go to the sink quick and use soap and water. When I'm finished with my video, I'm gonna go use soap and water, but for the video right now, so it goes quicker, I'm just gonna wipe it with this wet wipe, which actually, washable paint, done. Okay, then I'm just gonna dry my hand quick. Done, yes. Okay, finished with the paint. Now we're gonna move on to what goes next on here. So what we're making here is a card for the super, for the super special, bleh. Crazy Miss Penny, right? Okay, for the super special man in your life. He is going to be your superhero. So this says, it says, Daddy, you are my superhero. And then, kind of tiny, but it says 2021, which is the year. So this year is 2021. We're gonna carefully, I forgot to tell you that you might need scissors, I'm sorry. If you wanna run and grab some scissors quick, Addy, carefully hold them. Always hold your scissors like this when you're, when you're holding them because it protects the pointy part here, okay? So go grab some scissors because I forgot about telling you those, okay? Now, this is the part where you get to decide where you're gonna put all this, okay? If it's not daddy that you're making it for, you don't even need to use daddy, okay? So I'm just gonna cut each word out or you can keep all the words together. This is where you get to decide how you want to make your card for your dad or, or your special person, okay? You get to put the words wherever you want on your card. How neat is that? So I am going to keep superhero and 20, 2021 together. That's what I'm choosing to do. Now we're gonna open up our glue and stick glue will work just perfect for this, okay? so. I'm going to put some glue on. I'm using the word daddy for mine. And I am going to put daddy up here. And you, or again, you get to put it wherever you want on your card. This is just where I'm picking, okay? I'm gonna put daddy. And I'm gonna, before I put you or my, I'm gonna put superhero on because I'm gonna probably put those kind of close together, okay? So I'm gonna put superhero down here. There we go. There we go superhero superhero and now you are my can you fit right there with it that'll work yes see daddy you are my superhero and the year and oh guys there's one more see, i am not on my game today you caught me yeah you caught me all right we need one more thing guys and that is a crayon or a marker so if you'll just excuse me one moment, just one moment, guys, one moment. Oh, hold on. I'm still in the background, though, because I don't have to go far, and I got myself a marker. I'm using a permanent marker. You can use um, whatever your big person grabs for you, okay? So the last thing that you're going to want to do is write your name somewhere on the front because we have to remember who made this, okay? So I'm going to write Miss... Penny, because I made this in 2021. My card for my dad is complete. That's it. That's all. And save this for Father's Day. Your big person can help you hide it, okay? And then you can give it to your, your special person on Father's Day. And you can say, Dad or, or Grandpa or Uncle or whoever it is, 
You could be like, you're super, and give them a big hug. How cool would that be? So, you guys made your cool card, your superhero card. Now, let's sing a song, okay? Now you get to sing a song for your daddy. All right. I don't know how many of you know this song, but it's called Farah Jaka is the tune, okay? It's not the song, but that's kind of like the tune that we're going to use, all right? All right, let's see if we can get it. Let's see if Miss Penny can get it. <laughs> we'll see if we can get it together. All right, ready? I love daddy. I love daddy. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. All I want to say is happy Father's Day. I love you. I love you. Yay! You guys, you can you can do this. Let's do it one more time so we can sing it along together. Are you ready? I love daddy. I love daddy. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. All I want to say is happy Father's Day. I love you. I love you. Good job. Good singing along with me, everybody. You guys, you wish your special person happy Father's Day and you have lots of fun making the superhero card, okay? I will see you again next week. Bye.